I'm Angus, I'm an engineer by training. I live near Goodwood Oval. I uh, have a partner and two kids, young teenagers. Being a good neighbour means having a relationship with your neighbourhood um, and the connections and the social interactions and the mutual support that comes with that. But I think it, mostly it's just about looking out for each other and helping each other and being aware of you know, what's going on in each other's lives. It's great having friends who live you know, literally a 30 second walk away. Hey, how are you going? We often have a surplus of produce from the garden, so you know, we'll share that with the neighbours. We're pretty keen gardeners, we've been here for 10 years. Being able to get your hands dirty in the garden is, is a good thing and gets us out in the fresh air and gives us a purpose and gives us exercise. I, it probably just started with the sort of the cup of flour thing, you know, so one neighbour lacks a cup of flour and just knocks on the neighbour's door to see if they've got any flour that they can use rather than going to the shops. It's just, it's very unstructured and has developed over time. You know, if we're away at a particular time when fruit is ripening, we'll just say to the neighbours, look, we're not going to be home for the next two weeks. This fruit's ripening. We're not going to get to it. Please come and, you know, pick as much as you want. I'm Don Jarrett. I live in Black Forest and I've been here since 1982, I think. Now I'm probably one of the oldest persons, person in the street. However, such is life. Most of my neighbours weren't here when I came here and you watch their families grow up. It is just terrific seeing the, them growing up, taking off, going overseas, coming back, getting married. Sort of like a close family relationship, which is exactly what someone of my age needs. Tree is an apple gum. It's created a bit of interest, actually. People walking past, and if I'm out the front, they want to have a chat about the tree. Or people will be on the side of the street taking photos. People will want me to put up the table and uh, come over for a chat. A lot to chat about. Some people were saying, that looks good. We might have more of these here under the tree. I think it's really important sometimes to spend time with people who are, just happen to be nearby because, well, you can learn from them, but just the proximity of them means that there's a lot more opportunities for people to help each other. Just go for it. More often than not, it turns out to be positive and interesting and accepting. If you don't give it a go, you'll never know.